Greetings, greetings, all my dreamers and dreamettes. It's your boy Mickey Fenty, aka Mickey Made It. If you're new to this channel, you know what to do to this channel. Subscribe right now. And if you want to support the brand, it's inspiredbydreams.shop. Okay, let's get it. In the lively city of Atlanta, where hip-hop music filled the streets, lived a high school girl named Jasmine. She was bright and ambitious, dreaming of becoming a fashion designer. Her love for creativity matched her passion for music, especially the local rap scene. See, Jasmine's life took an unexpected turn when she met Malik, a rising star in the rap world. See, Malik, known by his stage name Lil Blaze, was charming and magnetic, drawing people in with his smooth lyrics and confident demeanor. Jasmine was captivated by him, and soon, their worlds intertwined. See, Jasmine and Malik's relationship began like a fairy tale. He showered her with attention, expensive gifts, and sweet words that made her feel like the most special girl in the world. Malik often took Jasmine to his recording sessions and performances making her feel like an integral part of his life. Her friends envied her, and she felt like she had found her Prince Charming. However, as Malik's fame grew, so did the temptations around him. Jasmine noticed changes in him, late nights, secretive phone calls, and a growing distance between them. Malik's charm had a darker side, one that emerged when he was stressed or under the influence. The first time Malik raised his voice and shoved Jasmine during an argument, she was shocked, but quickly forgave him, believing it to be a one-time mistake. One fateful evening, Jasmine decided to surprise Malik at his recording studio. As she walked in, her heart sank at the sight before her. Malik was intimately involved with another girl. Jasmine's world shattered in that instant. She confronted Malik, but his response was violent. He hit her. Her eyes filled with anger and betrayed. The other girl, unfazed, watched the scene unfold. Jasmine fled the studio, tears streaming down her face, feeling the pain she had never known. The next few days were a blur of emotional agony. Malik called, begging for forgiveness, but the damage was done. The final blow came when Jasmine learned that the other girl was pregnant with Malik's child. Consumed by heartbreak and betrayal, Jasmine began to lose herself. She withdrew from her friends, her passion for fashion dwindled, and her self-worth plummeted. She couldn't understand how she had ended up in such a dark place, chasing after a man who had only brought her pain. Her grades slipped and she stopped attending school regularly. The vibrant, ambitious girl she once was had become a shadow of herself. Malik's continued success was a constant reminder of her broken dreams and shattered heart. One evening, Jasmine found herself alone in her room, surrounded by memories of a love that had turned toxic. She stared at a photo of herself and Malik, tears blurring her vision. She realized she had lost more than just a boyfriend. She had lost her sense of self. In a final desperate act, Jasmine wrote a letter to her younger self, filled with regrets and lessons learned too late. She placed the letter on her desk along with the photo and left her home. As she walked through the dimly lit streets, she felt a deep sense of sorrow and loss. Jasmine's story ended on a tragic note, a tale of a young girl who lost herself in the pursuit of love from the wrong person. Her journey was a stark reminder of the importance of self-love and the dangers of losing oneself in a toxic relationship. Jasmine's light had dimmed, leaving behind a haunting legacy of a heart shattered by the very music and love she once cherished. Until next time, Mickey made it.